guys, so today I got in a shipment of dog bowls. I ordered all the boys another dog bowl uh, for a backup because I'm really bad at putting them in the dishwasher at night and not running the dishwasher. And then I have dirty bowls in the morning and then I've got to rush to wash them because the dogs are starving to death, you know, in the morning because <laughs> I always feed them when I get up. So, you know, they're starving to death. What can you do? You got to hurry up, wash the bowl. So I ordered them another to have a backup to have two bowls. <laughs> so I thought I always, this is another frequent question I get is, um, what dog bowl do I use? Because when I get new subscribers, they'll watch my old videos and see that the dog dish looks a little different than just a regular old plain old dog dish. So I thought I'd share that today with you since I just got them in. And here they are. They're called the Happy Hunting Bowl. And I got these on Amazon. I believe they were $7.98 a piece. I'm not sure. I'll uh, pop the price up here. Um, I know they were seven something. So they're linked in the description box below in my Amazon store if you're interested in checking them out. Um, I got one out here, right here. I got one out of the box here for you to show you. What it is, it's a, it's a dog bowl and then it has raised um, plastic pieces here like a maze. You put their dog food in here and they've got to work around this maze to get their food. So it slows them down tremendously when eating. If this maze was not in here, my boys would woof it down probably in 15 seconds. Um, I feed them three times a day, one fourth cup, three times a day, and they would woof it down. And what the problem is with them woofing it down is they would every now and then just throw it right back up <laughs> in whole pieces, just throw it back up. And ever since I've been using these bowls, which has been, um, I think I've been using this style for about a year and a half now. I was using other ones, but the, the maze, the in-between parts were a little too far apart so they could still eat pretty fast. So I got this one that's smaller, so they've really got to get in there and get the food. Um, about a year and a half, I have not had problems with them throwing their food back up since I've been using this bowl. And when dogs eat too fast, they can also get bloat. Um, Google bloat and you'll find out what that is. Um, so yeah, these have been working great. And I'm so happy to have another set. <laughs> so if I forget to run my dishwasher, I've got them. So now, um, bigger dogs, my dogs are all about 20 pounds. They're mini schnauzers. Um, bigger dogs may need, I I'm sure are going to need a bigger bowl and may need the ones with the wider uh, spaces between in the maze. So these may not work for say a, a Rottweiler, a big German Shepherd, um, you know, bigger dogs like that. I think it would work great for any dog probably up to at least 50 pounds. Um, so, and if you see here, they also sell one, here's the picture here, different style mazes too. This one has like raised hearts and then uh little dish compartment there and then you put it around here too so they may sell bigger um, bowls I'm not totally for sure so anyways hope you guys enjoyed this video and we will see you next time bye